Hey folks, I am at the Archery Trade Show in Indianapolis, Indiana for a couple of days and I'm just exploring around here. I'm going to bring you a couple of short videos, maybe half a dozen videos of some of the new products that I find and interesting things that are going on here at the show, maybe a personality or two. So uh, be sure and watch the Facebook page here today and tomorrow as I uh, bring you some, just a handful of short videos about some of the cool stuff that I find here at the show. This is not a show that just anybody can get in. It's all manufacturers, uh, archery dealers, and media that uh, attend this show, and it's really cool. It is ginormous. You cannot believe how big this show is. This is just one small section of it that you see behind me here. So anyway, stay tuned here during the next couple days, and you'll see some pretty cool stuff, I hope here with Dave and he's got a really unique new product uh, you really got to see this this is the Archer shot saver by MD 50 gear it's an exerciser warm-up in the field before you go shoot at tournaments basically I have three moves that I want you to work on and you're gonna draw it just like you would your bow let it back down draw it just like you would your bow this is what's called the draw then you also have the pull and as you pull this up nice and slow everything's nice and smooth then I have the push, you push out, push out. When you're doing the push, you're getting all of these front muscles that are supporting that front part when you're stabilizing your bow. When you're doing the pull, you're getting these muscles back here that really work on the rotator cuff and help stabilize the front. And then this is everything you use when you shoot your bow. Yeah. And obviously you ought to take and do the same thing on the other side to make sure that you're getting both sets of muscles warmed up and ready for field yeah so, awesome i'm definitely getting one of these because like i just said that was 22 below at home and i don't shoot my bow very much when it's 22 below great so this is great i can't wait to to use this probably daily thanks a lot yeah. appreciate it no problem thank you you bet hey i'm here with paul with wildlife research center today and uh wildlife research center's got uh, some new products out this year that are really cool paul's going to tell us about them thanks bernie first off we have uh, active cam uh, it's a year-round scouting scent. Uh, it's perfect to pre-scout your hunting area. And then when you get into hunting season, you might want to use some of the doe and estrus, active scrape, golden scrape, things like that. And then after the season, you know, after the rut, you want to check out what made it through the year, put some of this stuff out, and use it year-round. The nice thing about this, it's a non-urine-based formula. It's a curiosity scent. It's a scent, curiosity yeah. scent. So not only will you see a lot of deer, you'll see everything that's in the woods. Coyotes. Coyotes, bears, wolves. Cool. Um, foxes, you name it, you'll see it. We see bobcats, all that stuff. So that's kind of fun. Get your family involved too. So you got to spend all this money on cameras. Use them all year round. Yeah, Shoot. I'm a big advocate of using cameras year round. So that's yeah. perfect. I can't wait to try it. Next thing we launched the uh, No Zone last year, just a room spray, Aaron Aaron room deodorizer. We had the 32 ounce bottle. This year we come out with the 16 ounce bottle. You know, a little easier to handle, uh, better price point. Um, the thing is, we have the original unscented, and now we have the forest edge. It's just a just a hint of fresh cut cedar. A lot of people like that instant gratification of the smell that sure. it's working. Um, it's it's, a, it's just enough there that's not going to affect your clothing and your hunting and stuff like that. So. Yeah, I got to tell you a quick story about the no zone. Last year, you came out with that, and I took some on a hunting trip. I walked into my motel room, and I'm like, oh, I do not like the smell of this motel room. I don't want that smell on my camouflage clothing. So I took that no zone, I sprayed down the bedspread and the carpet and everything, and it just knocked it right down. I was really amazed. It's yeah, good it's stuff. It's really good. Use it in your cars and everything. Yeah, cool. Uh, and then one more quick thing here to have the, uh, in, in, I also, into, into the uh, no zone family, we're bringing out these, uh, Tamers. These are uh, little pucks that will like, actually absorb odors and moisture. You can just throw them in your totes, your backpacks, your boots. Um, inexpensive way and a safe way, a safe alternative to ozone where you can, uh, it won't wreck your clothing and it's, and it's safe. You won't have to worry about breathing it. So, cool. What's that? That's called a tote tamer. Tote tamer. Hey everybody, I am with Thomas and Kelly. And uh, we're at the Covert Scouting Cameras booth, and they've got a couple pretty exciting new products. Tell us about it. Okay, so new this year, we have our LoRa Link system. You have our um, LB and our LC. This is the base, and this is the camera. This base can hook up to nine of our devices here, so you can run all nine of them on this one base. And what's different about ours is that ours is not daisy chained. So if one, if this camera, the battery dies and you have eight other cameras, they're totally fine. Um, and nothing else happens to the other cameras. 
So with these, they can transmit up to 1,100 yards. Uh, which, which is about three quarters of a mile. So yes. that's really, really good. So with these, you only need one data plan. As far as our other cameras, you have each camera has its own data plan. This only has one plan for nine devices. Cool. And it is 32 megapixel, and that is new to us this year. Okay, what's what other what else do you have? Also down here we have the AW1 series. Now this is comparable to our Code Black and our Black Hawk. Right, um, which I use all the time. By the way, I really like them. <laughs> It has all the same features. You can change your settings on the app and all that good stuff. It's just a cheaper option. Only difference is this bad boy does not have a display screen. Ah, uh -huh. so that drops, what, 100, 150 bucks off the price? Right, it drops 100 off, yes. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. So you would set all of it up from our Covert Wireless app. Yeah, and it's a little smaller. Yes. Mm -hmm. I like it. Cool, and that'll either text or email you photos. That is correct, yes. All right. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll get out of your hair, but thanks, you guys. Great Thank stuff. You. I love covert cameras. Everybody knows that. Appreciate it. Thank you. And I'm here with Colby with Northwoods Bear Products, and everybody knows I love this stuff. They're one of our advertisers, and uh, he's going to tell you a little bit about their products. Hey, guys, I'll make it really quick. Uh, thanks, Bernie. These are our spray scents here. Um, each time you're in and out of a bait site, you're going to want to douse down the area with a spray scent. Uh, we call it ringing the dinner bell. It lets them know you're in and out of there. Uh, acts as a cover scent. Uh, wide variety of options there. Um, any one of them is great. Our next product, this is probably our number one seller. This is what we start every single bait site with. You take Gold Rush, it's a very, very potent butterscotch aroma. Uh, mix it with a little bit of fryer oil. Mix that up, dump it on the ground throw it up in the trees a little bit you're starting your bait really really well with that. yeah it's it's amazing cast. stuff i open every bait with it these days powders these are 500 times sweeter than sugar you can mix them with bait or just sprinkle them out by themselves around the bait site i would say that's the way we use these most often is around the bait site over things that are going to absorb a little bit of water um, take out some moisture it really gets in there uh, the bears will tear that stuff apart great stuff all all good stuff i really like this product thanks colby appreciate it thank you Okay, I'm with Mike here who has a really unique product for people that like to sit a long time. Maybe you're an all-day sitter for deer. Uh, all you bear hunters know that you spend a lot of time in the tree stand. He's got a really cool product here. Tell us about it, Mike. Okay. Hey, uh, hi, everybody. Uh, I'd like to introduce you to our product. Uh, it's called Pure Pro line of integral skin foam products. Basically, it's a polyurethane foam. Uh, we pour it into molds as the foam expands. It crushes the outside layer of foam around the mold and actually forms a very tough, durable, weatherproof skin. You can put patterns in it. You can add color to it. The color is added to the mold. It's actually reacted into the skin so it doesn't wipe off or anything like that. We have a couple different styles. We have seats with frames in them that you can mount um, and, and have a supportive back. We also have seats without frames that are honestly a little more comfortable and easy to kind of pack around if you need to take a minute out of your stance. It is super, super soft. I mean, I, I, I got to get one of these for bear hunting. It's amazing. So, yeah, new products lo manufactured locally here in Indianapolis. Um, well, it, yeah, looking he, for opportunities. And you're just introducing it here at the show, and I wish you the best. It, oh. I think you're really on to something. I, well, sitting in these, I just was amazed at how comfortable they are. He's got a ground blind chair that he's put together there. That's uh, that's just a prototype. But anyway, uh, man, I, I wish you the best, Mike. Uh, you, you're really on to something. Barry. You bet. I'm here yes, with I Cody DeQuisto with Lone Wolf Custom Gear. They have got some really cool products. You've heard of Lone Wolf before. They made quite a few improvements to them. Yeah, so what we have here is kind of that elite lineup for the ultimate in portability for whitetail hunting or any game you're after. So we have stands that are extremely light. Um, eight eight pound stand right here. We have a five pound as well. Double it frame pack. All of our products um, are designed to pack and stack seamlessly with low profile. So these sticks integrate right into the casting um, for really good transport. Also, the name of the game: lightening the load, making everything streamlined. This is our new camera arm. How much that thing weigh? It's super light. One point six pounds. Uh, unbelievable. Very light, very low profile. Uh, we actually call this thing the pocket arm because you could slip it right in your pocket. Amazing. It has twenty-eight inches of reach, and it mounts with this unique tree tooth uh, and a set screw that gets it very, very stable. And that uses the same strap basically as the sticks. Yes, it uses actually a little bit lighter weight to keep the weight down. Um, it's a micro buckle strap, uh, weighs just merely ounces. 
Awesome. Boy, you guys have been doing really good stuff for a long time. This is awesome. Thank you, Cody. Thanks Appreciate it. All right, I'm here with David Block, who is with Outdoor Edge. You've all heard of them. They're a very trusted uh, brand of knives and tools for hunters. What do you got new this year, David? I want to show you uh, some really cool new knives. So one is the Razor Max. This is a replacement blade knife, and it's our first fixed blade replacement blade knife. So uh, hunters like fixed blades because it makes them easy to clean. What's cool here is this is a five inch bony fillet blade. It also comes with our standard three and a half inch drop point blade. Oh, sure. So here is a nice skinny wow, knife. Wow, change is easy. Basically push the lock button on the side. So, so here you have a replacement blade, nice skinny knife. I'm gonna push that button, take the blade out. Now I have a bony fillet blade. And with that longer blade, you can see that that flexible tip there. Sure. So uh, great for deboning, cutting your meat. And then um, this all comes in a, with a sheath. There's also a carrier for all your spare blades. Now I just showed you two blades. I'm gonna use two blades. So how do I pack them out safely? Well, this includes a molded box. It's called our blade box. And you basically take your extra blade, store it in the box. The sheath has this pouch that stores your new blades and your blade box. Sure. And that's also removed. And when you buy so, a knife, you get a selection of blades. You, you get do. six you of each or something? You get, get six six blades with the knife. You get three uh, drop point blades and three um, three boning blades. Cool. Brand new for this year, I'm gonna show you the razor bone. So here's a fixed blade with the longer five inch blade. The razor bone's brand new, and it is a true folder that you can close that five inch blade. What we added to the razor bone this year is it comes with a five inch blade, comes with a three and a half inch drop point blade and our new gutting blade. So gutting razor blade, cuts cool. amazing. Nice Great. and thin, I put that in my knife. Now I can zip open the hide, cut down the legs, cut down the belly, make those clean cuts. Super sharp and, too. Uh, three blades and one knife, super lightweight, easy to carry. It's all you need to get the job done. Great, well thought out products. Thank you, David. Thank you. Okay, I'm back with Paul here in the Wildlife Research Center booth, and uh, he's going to show us another really neat product, kind of a retro craft beer takeoff product, yeah. I guess you'd say. Thanks, Bernie. We have, uh, in honor of the two founders of the company, we, uh, Sam, the president, now actually went into the vaults, grabbed some of the original recipes that we had. Uh, they changed through the years because of cost, but we decided to bring them back. Um, this here is Trapper John, in honor of John Bergeson, and then we have... Uh, Tra Trapper John's Ultimate Buckler, and we have uh, Chainsaw Brian uh, Premium Dull Asterisk. So the deal with this is these are actually brewed in small batches. So it's not a, it's not available to everybody, but it's a, it's a super premium product. Um, and, you know, we're excited about it because the product works well. Okay. It's, it's so it's going to be a premium product with a little higher price point than the run-of-the-mill yeah. stuff. But just I, I can't wait to try it because I know the 307 was... Um, that was kind of, that sort of broke, that it started. broke the buck lure business wide yep. open. And that's, and that's kind of what this is here. That's the original formula. Yeah, the original cool. Formula right awesome. Okay. Thank you, Paul. Thanks, Charlie with Irish Setter Boots, and they've got a new boot that's really cool, and uh, he's going to explain it to us. Hi. This is our new uh, uh, BOA version of our Vapor Trek. Uh, Vapor Trek came out in 2019 last season. Uh, this is a line extension to it. Uh, it's a super lightweight boot uh, that uh, has great durability, great comfort underfoot. Uh, and what we've done here with this boot is we put a new, lace, a different lacing system in it. Uh, and we're calling this called the BOA system. So uh, traditional lace-up boots uh, uh, can untie, um, need retightening sometimes. With the BOA, with the BOA boot, you just uh, snap the dial, turn it, and tighten it up and you can uh, re-tighten at any time uh, with just a click of the, of the bowl. Can you do it with gloves on? You can do it with gloves on, you can do it with mittens on, uh, so it's super easy. Then you just pull on it, pull out, wow, that and is cool. then you can get out of the boot real quickly. So in and out is very, uh, very quick and efficient, and then uh, tightening is just a turn of the dial. Okay, and this boot is a fabric boot, which might be good for, say, elk or pronghorn hunting, but you also have a full leather boot that's waterproof. 
Correct. And so yeah, so depending on what your purpose of the boot you want for it, uh, super lightweight with some fabric. Fabric is durable as well, but we do have all leather versions as well uh, that add more durability to the boot. All right. Thanks, Charlie. That's Irish Setter Boots, long, a long time uh, manufacturer of really good quality footwear. Appreciate it. Thank you.